I told you that we would be saying Merry Christmas again, right? Today, I've come back to this incredible state to spend an afternoon with its amazing citizens. You are amazing. To help push our plan for historic tax cuts right across that finish line. We're going to do that. I will tell you this in a non-braggadocious way. <laughs> there has never been a 10-month president that has accomplished what we have accomplished. That I can tell you. The Senate must pass those tax cuts. Bring Main Street roaring back, and that's what's going to happen. This is all done without the tax cuts. And I'm not sure that people even believe the tax cuts. I want to see what happens. And the big day will be either tomorrow or the next day. I would say, do it now. We're ready. <laughs> and then what happens, if it passes, it goes into this beautiful committee, this beautiful, I call it a pot. And we mix it up, and we stir it up, and we bring all the best things out. And you're going to have something, I predict, that will be really, really special. We're also going to eliminate tax breaks and complex loopholes taken advantage of by the wealthy. Who are they? I don't know. I think my accountants are going crazy right now. It's all right. Hey, look, I'm president. I don't care. I don't care anymore. I don't care. Some of my wealthy friends care. Me, I don't care. This is a higher calling. Do we agree? As Hillary said, what difference does it make? It made a difference. Made, it made a big difference. Made a big, big difference. And a lot of this was from many, many years ago when we defended a defeated country, and then they became strong, and they became rich, and we just kept the same defense. What happened? Why didn't anybody go in and negotiate? And when I was in Asia, I spoke to a couple of the countries about it. And they look like this. You know what this is? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That means they know they're getting away with murder, and they got to start helping us out, OK? We have tremendous support for this plan. Tremendous. Because these massive tax cuts will be rocket fuel. Hmm. Little rocket, man. Rocket fuel for the American economy. He is a sick puppy. With Trump as your president, we are going to be celebrating Merry Christmas again. And it's going to be done with a big, beautiful tax cut. Thank you, everybody. God bless you. Thank you.